what Buhari has done and why Buhari is in this kind of problem is because some Nigerians seem to be more important to him than the others. I have friends everywhere. When I went to Meduguri, I slept in Alaji Kashim Ibrahim's house. How? We've been friends of over 20 years. He's APC. He left his bedroom. What would you do differently when I to went defeat to Iloni? insecurity? You are, you are, that's the question. What would you do differently to defeat uh, insecurity? I, that's, that's what I'm telling you. You, you, you cannot defeat if you don't have faith in Nigeria. You, are going, you must treat people equally. That's number one. Number two, that's what they call crime and punishment. Today, the, the kind of body language that I see is such that those who perpetrate this madness in Nigeria feel they have people who can protect them. Trust me, I, I read somewhere a few days ago that General Sonia Abacha, when this kind of thing that happened in Sokoto happened, he didn't say because he's a Muslim. He didn't say because he's from Kano and things like that. He went after them. Every time, all we hear from this government is which I deal with them. I have asked the security forces. I have asked. Nothing happens. You see, the body language of the leader matters. So that, I can tell you, I will do different. Number two, we must invest in, in intelligence. In anywhere in the world, there is nobody who relies only on guns and ammunition. Your spies must be well trained, must be well equipped, and you must give them incentives. Our soldiers are amongst the best. I can tell you that Dele Momodu is probably the only person in the last 20 years who has been interacting with soldiers, even our own soldiers, in Liberia, in Sierra Leone. I used to go there to go and give them incentives, buy the charge cards for some people to be able to you know, phone their families. In Liberia, Nigerian soldiers controlled 10 out of 15 counties. They have 15 counties in Liberia. I saw it firsthand. How come today we are not able to control Sambisa Forest? It, something is wrong with the leadership. So once you have a leader who knows his onions, once you have a leader who is bold and courageous, once you have a leader who is ready to do everything within his capacity as the commander-in-chief, it will drive those people out of this country. That is what we need to do. So...